Hey guys, so I did celery juice. Medical mediums, celery juice every morning, 16 odds, first thing when you wake up on an empty stomach for two months. So I was originally gonna do this video and upload it when I'd done it for a month. And then I was like, I wanna give it the time to run its course to truly know if it helped me or not. I made a video diary, so I did day one, hey guys, this is how I'm feeling, day two, hey guys, this is how I'm feeling, day three, and it, like, you guys do not want to watch 60 days of that, it's boring, so in summary, day one, when I first drank the celery, I was doing a litre, because medical medium says 16 hours or 32 hours, which in Australia is 500 mils or a litre, basically, so I was like, you know what, I'm gonna go all in, so I did a litre. This is so too much information, but I was bloated, but like gassy and uncomfortable. And there was just absolutely no chance of me going to the bathroom for the next like year. Like it was not a good time. And it kind of didn't settle. And that's when I was like, whoa, I've either got something really wrong in my tummy or it's killing off stuff or this is all a lie. Second day wasn't much better. Third day. Good morning. We are on celery juice day three. I have been bloated. I don't look very bloated in this dress, but I've been really bloated. My stomach's been sore for the last two days. It's meant to help that. After day seven, because I read so many articles being like, I did celery for seven days. And this is what happened. I was like, I want to opt out of this. My skin's breaking out. My tummy was still pretty irritated. Every time I drink it, it wasn't as bad as the first couple of days, but I was bloated. And nothing I could read online was people saying that. So I was like, is it just me? Does it just not agree with me? Like, I don't know what's going on. It's day 11 on celery. Probably too much information, but my bladder's been a bit weird. Hmm. But we'll see how that goes. Now, if you're a girl watching this, you know, girls get UTIs, things like that. When you have kidney issues like me, sometimes it happens. I didn't get a UTI, but I just had these weird like bladder sensations. So I was like, maybe a liter is like a little bit excessive. A liter of celery juice, like that's one stalk and a half of celery juice every morning. Do you know how many serves of vegetables that is? And in my brain, I was like, I think this is a little bit excessive. So I went down to 16 odds. And that was when the game changed. My skin started clearing. My tummy was less bloated. And I felt like my moods were actually more balanced, which is all the things that it said. So I actually think that all in isn't always better. More is definitely not more. And that's my biggest tip with this whole celery juice saga. I don't think a liter of celery juice is warranted, just in my opinion. Third week of doing it, my skin had got a lot better here and here because celery juice, I think, well, I found it worked on my stomach. So I had a lot of acid reflux. I had problems with my stomach where I had low stomach acid. I found my stomach, no more acid reflux. Win, so amazing. I was actually digesting my food. I still had the bloating, but that's my intestines and my SIBO and all that fun stuff. But it helped my stomach so much. And I know when my stomach's irritated because I get breakouts here, here, like all on the like apples of my cheeks. And I didn't get any breakouts there, it cleared all of them. And in March, I was getting a few breakouts because I got a stomach bug and it messed my acid in my stomach so much. So the sodium cluster salts that are in celery, I do believe are incredibly healing. My doctor in LA is big on salts. And a lot of doctors tell you, no salt, salt's bad for you. But literally, I genuinely believe the sodium cluster salts. My skin went so soft, not just on my face, like all over my body, my skin went really, really soft as if it had just like taken the layer of the top of my skin off. It was like baby skin and it's still really, really soft. So that was awesome. Week four of doing it, kind of the same thing. Still had no breakouts on my cheeks, awesome, but still had a little bit of bloating. Up until one month to six weeks was kind of the same, but the bloating started to subside. I think my body had just got used to it and my stomach was a lot better, but to be honest, I didn't feel anything other than that. So it didn't heal my rosacea. I only did it for two months. Maybe I should have done it for longer. 
it definitely helped my stomach. If you have stomach issues specifically, it was a game changer for me. Like it actually allows me to digest food now, which is awesome. I mean, that's pretty important. <laughs> By the six week mark, my skin was really soft. I had no breakouts on the apples of my cheek, but I was hormonally breaking out, which was really random because I don't really get hormonal breakouts, but I don't know, maybe it was the celery doing something. And my skin was so soft, which we love. Apart from that, I still had my bloating. It definitely didn't fix, sorry for the information, it didn't fix constipation. That's just part of my life because of my SIBO. I don't go to the bathroom, you know, I'm just, I'm a fairy and apparently fairies don't go to the bathroom, whatever. Something I haven't touched on is I actually got diagnosed with Epstein-Barr virus and that was the start of this year. And after the two months of celery juice, my diagnosis came back negative. So it said that basically the virus had gone to sleep and it does say the celery works on that. So if you do have Epstein-Barr, I think it's beneficial. If you do have stomach issues, I think it's beneficial. If you have skin issues, I think it's beneficial. Do I think it's the wonder juice? No. Do I think it's going to solve all of the world's problems for health? No. But for a juice that is readily available, and this is what I always say, like medicine should be available to us and it should be something you can grow in the garden. I don't believe that you have to ship something from the Amazon to get healthy. I believe that mother nature doesn't actually want us to be sick. It did a really amazing job. These are my biggest takeaways from this video. Unless you're a big person, like a six foot plus person that's just super muscular and whatever, I would only do 500 mils. 500 mils of celery juice, do it for at least six weeks to two months. If you have stomach issues, it's hugely beneficial. And if you have breakouts on the apples of your cheeks, it's also hugely beneficial. If you have rough or dry skin, hugely beneficial all over your body. Really, really helped me. If you have Epstein-Barr virus, really, really, really helped me. So those are my takeaways. I don't think it's a miracle juice, but I do think it's pretty amazing. So I just wanted to share you guys because I know so many of you are thinking of trying it and it is a lot of effort getting up and juicing every morning, but I do really believe it's worth it. So I hope that gives you a little bit of insight. I mean, try it. Why not? I don't have thyroid issues like he talks about that it helps. I don't have other autoimmune disease like fibromyalgia that he says that it helps. So I can't speak. All I can speak about is my personal experience with it. And my experience was really good. It didn't fix everything that I have going on, but it definitely helped. And I will take that. So I hope that helps. I love you guys. I'll talk to you really, really soon. Um, but yeah, moral story, go get some celery.